Morted. So here's some fun with new in something that's always the same. This guitar fretboard is nothing but a repetition of the same 12 notes over and over and over again, higher and lower. It's all the same. You know, so we're playing our chords up here. And let's say you start strumming a couple chords and I'm going to play a solo over it. And I just start soloing. Say we're in G. And I'm soloing in the G position. And it has this nice country flavor. It'll always have that nice little country flavor happening. If I take it to another position, same chord, to the D position, and all of a sudden that country flavor went away. Now we're more into a happy, moody, blue sound. The different positions give totally different sounds. Different styles of music sometimes. If you play something that really has a minor quality to it, and I come up with come out with this G pattern. Boy, did I ever throw some fucking country flavor into what you were trying to make as some like rainy day moody type thing. This is um, what is new in something that is always the same. We could have two notes that are the same note, the E, the high E, and the low E. Yeah, they're the same note. See, if you don't know this, you think that they are different notes. No, this is the same note, E and a low E. What makes them different is, of course, the timbre, but it changes everything from the same exact two notes. These are the kinds of fun things where if you take the time to learn this thing yourself using all the techniques, you're on for a fucking awesome fucking road of, dis of discovery if you open your fucking eyes, open your fucking mind, open your heart, and let it all be revealed to you. You can do, all, you can do that or you could just, you know, play and have fun. But I'm just opening you, opening you up to, you're not only learning this. This is how every fucking thing works. This is a representation of the universe built into an instrument. It's the whole fucking thing.